Michelle Valentine. I'm an author and an advice columnist, and I'm going to be answering your dating, love, and sex questions. And I'm going to be answering them here, as well as answering them with my girlfriends. So let's hear what Confused in Texas writes. Dear Michelle Valentine, I just got out of a long-term relationship, so I'm a little bit out of the loop on the proper etiquette of modern dating. I've gone on dates and some guys were all over me and tried to get me to go home with them on the first date, and some guys never even kissed me goodnight. How long should you wait before you have sex with someone you're dating? Well, confused in Texas, you should wait as long as possible before getting physically involved with someone. You know, of course, it depends if you're seeing that person once a day or once a week or once every few months. Of course, you should be seeing him more than once every few months. But, again, you should wait as long as possible. Take your time before getting physically involved. Get to know them as a person. Make sure they're your friend. Make sure that they're someone that you would consider being with for a long-term basis. That's the best advice that I could give. So let's hear what my girlfriends have to say. So, Sue. What, what do you think she should do? How long should she wait before having sex? Well, personally, on the waiting for the right time for sex, I always like to at least wait till after dessert. <laughs> because nothing <laughs> comes before chocolate. But frankly, <laughs> I'm not sure that that was really what she was looking for. Now, you're not talking dessert on a first date, right? Well, I hope that you get dessert on every date. <laughs> right, right, right. And right. then maybe another dessert <laughs> after that. A little chocolate cake yeah. is always good. <laughs> exactly, exactly. But no, I agree with you. It really depends on what kind of a connection you have. You know, obviously, you get involved with somebody too soon, you know, you might end up having sex, they don't call you the next day. That never makes you feel good, you know. But then at the same time, you could date somebody for months, then you finally find out that you really don't connect in that area, and then how disappointing is it to wait six months right. when obviously you could have found that out months ago. Right. <laughs> Well, <laughs> so you're right. It really depends on what kind of a connection you have. And <laughs> I know Teal is going to have probably a totally different answer than Sue. What, what would you say? <laughs> well, honestly, I came from a Christian background, so I was always raised to not have sex before marriage. I went against that, actually, and I was just like that, that woman that wrote to you. Uh -huh. And I had guys that would come on to me the first date. Some didn't call me back. I decided to go back to the way that I was raised and wait for marriage because oh, I think that will work better for me. Well, it worked for my mom and my, my father and they've been together for about 25 years. Aww. So, Aww. yeah, and they were both each other's first <laughs> loves. So. Well, that's great. So you're going, like, you're going backwards now. So yes, I'm going good. backwards because the other way it didn't <laughs> work for me. It might work for Sue. Good luck. <laughs> <laughs> And Audrey, what, what do you think she should do? Well, I think it's it's not, you know, a length of time. It's all about really finding that time where you, you both have that connection to where you're both ready. It's a mutual thing. And, you know, I've, I've slept with guys before. I've even gone out on a date with them. But <laughs> and, and that, that's turned into relationships for uh -huh, me. And, okay. it, you know, it's different for everyone. Uh -huh. So I think you really need to go within yourself and see if you are ready for that and don't do anything before you're not ready. Right, right. Yeah, definitely. And you should definitely take your time. So everyone everyone does kind of agree though that you should still take your time. Yes, right? Definitely. I mean kinda that should be the best advice. So yes. everyone out there take your time and uh, go from there. Okay, well that's it for for Dear Michelle Valentine today. And again, if you have any questions about dating, love or sex, be sure to visit www.michelle.com. Valentine.tv